Okay, I just not looked over at my recording, and I was not recording, guys. Um, yeah, mistakes were made, okay? I'm still within, like, the first, like, 30 minutes of my session. But pretty much what I'm doing right now, right? Okay, so it's day four, and I'm not rated, and I just want to let that be known, right? What's funny is that I started recording, but then I noticed that my mic wasn't coming through at all, so then I fixed that issue and stopped recording as I was fixing that issue. I guess that I forgot to hit my record button after I started uh, talking again through the mic, and, like, it started coming through. Um, I'm just happy that I just noticed right now. I just looked over, noticed that I wasn't recording, noticed kind of early on, but yeah, you guys missed a little bit of stuff, but that's okay, I guess. All right. Mistakes were made. Happy accidents. Bob Ross is here to save, uh, save my mind, okay? Just paint on the canvas and let your mind go where it goes. Yeah, the main goal today is to get a tier three down and start raiding, right? And so to do that, we, we already have like 40 high call inside of my base and like 500 scraps. So we need a hundred high call. Um, for the tier three and we need a thousand scrap for the tier three. So that's where we are. Sorry Sorry that you guys missed the past bit of me not recording But I mean I'm out here running straight miles around the map looking for fuses like a goose. That's silly fuse Oh God game help me, please. Oh Thanks, they helped me out with food. Oh small oil rig is up. That's great. The thing is though Oh man, I should probably get sulfur cooking inside my furnaces before anything because what's the point on going out and doing all this grinding for a tier 3 and shit when we're going to have to farm sulfur and let it cook afterward, right? So, honestly, before I go to power plant and get that red card, then go to underwater lab, I think that we're going to need to go out on a mining run. And then also maybe like a small wood run to keep furnaces cooking. And I see someone comment, how do you get the numbers under your hot bar? I thought that was just automatically added for everybody. Oh, yeah, show belt bar binds. Oh, yeah, yeah, there we go. Yeah, it's just in this session. Uh, session done. It's just in this section. Okay, you guys are making me stumble on my words. That's not a nice guy move man. Come on and not to mention I have to use the restroom Oh my god, it's like being a hungry rat looking at a triangular prism of some cheese and just not being able to eat it You know, you just have to you just have to hold the temptation the temptation of going to the bathroom and setting off a nuclear bomb And yeah, we actually got 762 scrap. Holy shit 95 high call. I can actually make a tier 3 right now I may not even have to go to underwater lab or even really need to get a red card when I think about it. Holy shit. The moment that I get back home, though, I'm probably going to hit craft on the tier three, but then I'm going to um, go use the restroom. Then we're going to do a mining run, get a lot of fucking sulfur, hopefully, out there in the snow. Because we live somewhat near the snow, which is dope. So mining should not be much of a concern for us. I'm just like, I don't know, like I'm mildly upset that I wasn't recording before this because now I lost out on some footage for the day. So, but you know what, Dylan? Who gives a flying fuck? All right, let's get it. Yeah, here we go. Give me that freaking tier three, baby. Let's go. Let's go. I'll be right back. There we go. All right, nice. All right, let's go. Mining run time. And I see some one comment. Uh, we need a silly goose mug. Yeah, a silly goose mug definitely has to come out one day. And then I also see someone comment. I only listen to hip hop too. You're not the only one, but I listen to more of the 2000s hip hop. I'm about 36, and the music was different back then. It definitely was. But that's not the. I mean, there's still good artists today, man. Believe it or not, like I'm into like the 90s, like the Wu Tangs, the N. Well, I mean, like, I don't listen to much NWA. That's not really my style. That's a little bit too old school sounding for me. I feel like, but I respect it, right? Like I know the history of it, and uh, I mean, like yeah, yeah. Like, those are, like, like that's where a lot of the greats were at, man. Tupac, Nas, Eminem. Um, they had, like, Mob Deep, Wu-Tang, A Tribe Called Quest. Like, I mean, the list goes on and on when it comes to, like, the legends back then. Outcast. That was, I mean, it gets debated on, like, what the golden age of hip-hop was. Because it started back in the 80s, I think, with, like, Rock Kim and KRS-One and LL Cool J and, like, all those guys. Those guys are pioneers to, to a lot of the people that came in the 90s. And I know that, even though I haven't listened to a whole lot of those people's music as of yet, I know, like, a lot of the general history of it. But I still think there's a lot of good rap that's out today. There's a lot of trash that's out today, without a doubt. There's a lot of trash that's out. But there's also a lot of artists that still have good integrity and a really sharp pen. It's just about uh, giving some of it a try, man. What is that? Okay, I know. This is sulfur down here. Cool. Yeah, we're going to get all the sulfur in the world, okay, guys? That guy had an ice pick on him, by the way. Oh, no. Sir, what's your name? Hey, man. Can I keep my pick so I can keep on going? Yeah. Why did he... Why did he have fun kill... Wait. Sir, what are we doing? Hey, can I keep my... Actually, no, I know. I think that he just now died to cold. Poopy butt. Poopy, poopy butt. Listen, okay, sir. I left your pickaxe on your body. Go back and get that shit, okay? Okay, we back. We back. We back. We back. All right. 
Wait, do I still have more sulfur over here? Oh, I do. Oh, yeah, dude. We're actually... Yeah, we're gonna definitely be able to raid today. Oh, yeah. I wasn't 100% sure if we were gonna be able to, but yeah, we're, we can definitely raid. I'm just gonna hard smelt two things of sulfur here, and then one thing of metal in the back there, I guess. Yeah, we're just gonna be crafting up this GP right now. Um, I see someone comment, hey Dylan, I have never played Rust and found your channel a while back and I've been watching since. How old are you, if you don't mind me asking? I'm somewhere between the age 21 and 83. Yeah, shit, we're already sitting on 1800 GP. We're pretty much already ready to raid. Shit. We just need more sulfur cooked up to get up to 2k total and then, uh, we're gonna need 400 cooked sulfur to make the explosives that we need, but yeah. Shit, so where should I go right now? I guess just outside to get wood, yeah. I'm gonna put this MP5 away, though. I don't wanna get wood with an MP5. Fuck that. All right, shit, actually, I wonder if uh, oil rig's being taken right now. Oh, yeah, there's a tug here. Aw, oh, shit. Um, yeah, we gotta go. We gotta go there now. I don't even know how many people are even gonna be there, but yeah, like, let me get my MP5 real quick. Oh, my God, dude, we gotta go. I, again, I don't even know if I'm even gonna make it there in time. I might not, but a man must try, okay? Dylan, you still need to make a freaking boat base, my guy. <laughs> I've yet to do that, man. I just, I don't know, like, I'm not in, like, the building groove right now, guys. I'm sorry. Yeah, I don't. I think that the boys are gone. But, I mean, you want to know the bright side? Cargo's out right now, and I could go there. <laughs> Do I want to go cargo? I mean, I mean, people have been asking, like, me to go cargo this wipe. I'll go cargo right now, I guess. It's just right down here, so why not? Yeah, definitely whiffed out the whole oil rig countering situation. Dude, I'm just wondering how many people it was. I mean, maybe it's for the best that I didn't counter. Because if it was, like, six or seven guys, I mean... I would probably still try and counter, but it, it probably wouldn't work out, and I would just lose an MP5. And, like, I don't know if it's just me, but it feels like cargo is going the opposite way on the map now. I used to go this way, like, the opposite way that it's, that it's going right now. Like, I don't know. Ever since this harbor update, they, they changed the direction that it goes, like, around the map. And now here I am, and I don't know where things are going to go, but I might start getting crazy. I know cargo just recently came out, so it hasn't been out for a while. Yeah, I'm still seeing the bot on the front. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. The shit that I'm a little bit confused about is that, like, I heard one of them shooting on here, it sounded like. Fuck, dude. This bot down here is still alive. I thought that they killed that bot. Yeah, yeah, because one of them killed the shit over there. Okay, one minute, dude. We can give this a go. One second. I'm just going to push over here to the complete other side right now. And just go for it. That's them shooting off their tug over there, though. One second. Flank through underneath right now. Yeah, one second here. That guy's dead. Cat, one second.
Yeah, this is gonna be a fucking bitch. I don't know, it's like I'm hearing them up there, but yeah, there's there's two of them that are up there right now, so. Holy shit, dude. <laughs> Fuck me. Oh my god. Yeah, guys, about this whole thing. Dude, oh my god, now this is fucked. I'm fighting like a four-man team on this bitch right now. Same guys from Oil Rig, by the way, obviously. But, I mean, like, they just have infinite respawns. They can just keep it going. They, like, they don't have to stop anytime soon, right? They can just keep on fucking respawning. I don't really know, like, what we should do. You know what I mean? Like, like we can keep killing them all the way along, but it's not gonna get anything done. They can just keep it going and keep it going. Because right, like, right now, this second, I think there's still two that are on here with me. Very, very certain. I don't think that naked was one of the two that I mentioned earlier. The other two were over there by the other staircases that led down. Then I pushed over here, fought this guy, and that was that. I'm starting to feel like it might just be worth just, like, me tucking myself on here to fight them later. But, like, at the same time, I'm not trying to be, like, a little bitch and, like, run away. But if, if they did not have a tugboat, I would be down to stay on here 100%. Wait, I just not heard one down there. Was that all the way down there, or was that, like, just, like, right down here? I don't even know. Yeah, I'm hearing their tugboat right now. Oh, shit. Okay, give me a second here. I'm not doing the best at filling up my backpack right now. I'm kind of stumbling with that. I don't know, man. I feel like I should just take the rib off the back and just fucking run, dude. I'm just gonna do that. I've got my little bit of profits from this shit, man. Let's just... Ah, oh, fuck. Well, they're gonna be back here if I drop. That's the issue. That's okay. Fuck it. Let's go. I could probably kill this full metal guy, actually, you know. Sir, don't even, don't even try it, okay? Don't even fucking try it right now. Don't even do it, okay? That's enough out of you. Okay. Yeah, I'm leaving right now, man. I'm leaving. I'm out of there. I got my little bit of profits. I don't know if I grabbed... I think there might be another Tommy that I'm missing over there, but... I'm just gonna take this shit home, man. It's worth it. I'm not doing this infinite respawning shit with them for them to kill me at some point, man. I'm just not doing it. Yeah. Okay, we're back home. That, 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 that's also another reason why I just wanted to leave is just because I'm, like, right next to my base, too. It didn't take long for us to get back. So. Yeah. Okay. Holy fuck. And I'm, of course, just gonna be running into the whole fucking world as I'm out here, too, I'm sure. Sar, huh? What's weird is that there was a Tommy guy around here somewhere. Not a Sar guy. When I was last over here. See, and the vibe that I get from that guy right there is that he was camping on the coast waiting for me type of shit. And that's why I went so wide over there. To, uh... Ferry terminal. Because I just had a little feeling. Because the Tommy guy shot at me, like, from around the coast when I left last time. Okay, made it back home, dude. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, beautiful run right there, man. We were owning those guys on cargo. And it would have been cool to continue going, man, but my MP5 is getting weak. I could just use the Tommy, but I'm going to lose one of these 1v1s at some point, man. I'm going to get caught off guard or something. It's just, let's just go back home and bank, man. That's how I feel. Do I even have a full metal set yet? Because, like, I have this AK right here. I have a face mask there, a hoodie. Like, I don't have a full... Actually, no, okay, yeah. So we have this road sign set that we could use with AK, I guess. But just replace the helmet with the face mask. Okay, okay. Wait, Dylan, Dylan, you still have a bow inside your box. Can you drop that shit? 
Yeah, I've actually had these traps inside my base for a few days. Uh, yeah, don't. You should probably place down the traps as you have them. Okay. Pretty, pretty basic stuff. <laughs> nah, no, but we're actually ready to raid, though. We have all of our sulfur cooked up, I believe. Yep, tech trash time. Yeah, we're actually doing really, really good on tech trash, dude. Let's go. Uh, yeah, 2C4 on the way. All right, cool. Yeah, so I'm probably going to dip and go and start roaming and looking for a base to raid. I already have one base in mind, though, and it has a... Pretty much it's a 2x2 two two full stone with a drop box on it. Drop boxes on bases, they just give me a really good feeling. Yeah, someone was actually asking me where the flame raid grind was at. I still don't even have Molotov researched. I could research it if, like, I tried hard enough, but... And, I don't know, like, I, I have seen some flame raid opportunities around the map, but not enough to really make me want to start flame raiding like crazy. It'll probably come at some point th throughout this season, though. Maybe tomorrow. So, yeah, the base that I want to raid... Wait, was it this thing? Did he expand? Oh, no. Okay, I actually might not be able to raid the base that I thought I was going to be able to. Um... Is this a 2 by 2 Oh, yeah, dude, this is a 2 by 2 yeah. Shit. Yeah, no, dude, this guy upgraded the guy that I wanted to raid. Shit. Well, we gotta find something else. All right. See, like, what the fuck is this thing right here, man? Like, it looks weird because, like, oh, yeah, like, there's wood. Don't raid that. But, like, he has solar panels up top, and I don't think that there's honeycomb on this shit, man. My oh, yeah, dude, like, there's even electric furnaces in here. There's no honeycomb back here, man. Ah, oh, there is sheet though. Fuck. Damn. I don't know how exactly I would uh, how exactly I would want to execute that because there's probably going to be doors inside that we can't afford to go through. See someone comment? Not me eating sausages when shots needs to be dropping some Lincoln logs. Right, and by the way, may I just mention this very very quick? Okay. In the past video, my map had leaked, and I will say, not seeing many stream snipers around here. Very very grateful for that. Thank you guys. I actually just now heard a SAR shoot over here near Ferry Terminal. I'm going to push this way. I feel like it's the same SAR guy that I killed when I got back with the rib. Thankfully, I didn't die to that guy either, man. He was running right at me. Dude, where is this guy with the SAR? Dude, I feel like I'm going to get shot out of nowhere soon. He's over here somewhere. It's SAR guy, where the fuck are you, man? I wonder if he's just recycling. Okay, I just now got like a mini... What the hell are we doing? Why are we sitting in the bushes like silly gooses? What the hell are you doing, man? What is your name? Let me just see. Della? Is that the same guy as before? I don't even know. Jesus. What are we thinking? I wonder what the odds are that that guy comes back again right now. Because, like, just seeing him sit in a bush just makes me feel like he was just trying to bait me over here type of shit, right? Like, isn't that just weird? I mean, there's a dead body right here with bandages. What the fuck? Dead guy right there. Okay, give me a second here. Wonder if this is the same guy. I mean, he got back very, very quick for it to be the same dude, I feel like. I feel like he's over there by the recycler crouching around right now. That's what my gut tells me. He's, like, crouching around, like, around the recycler trying to clear me out. Let's see how spot on I am with this. Played. GG's. Definitely outplayed me right there. And Nelly. Okay, so that's the guy that we saw dead by the recycler. I'm actually surprised that my nade just now whiffed right there. That was a bad nade on my part. I'll go back out there, though, see if these guys are all still over there. So, yeah, like, that's not the same guy. The other guy's name started with a D. It was, like, Deli or some shit. I don't know. I forget what it was. But, yeah, we definitely had the right play, but I completely whiffed that out. That should have been my, my, my win right there all day. I choked, though. All that I know is that it's just, like, I hate this fucking bush camping shit because both these guys have just been camping in bushes from the jump. Just right at the very start of each fight, they're both just camping in bushes, and it's like, okay, I love that so much. Like, I don't know if it's just surprising to me how many bushes just spawn specifically on roads. Like, look at this path. All these bushes are specifically generated around this road. Like, we need to reduce that shit, man. Like, it's a problem. Way too many bushes on roads and railroad tracks. Because, yeah, it goes for both roads and railroad tracks. Oh, wait. I just not... Oh, yeah. I just not saw someone over there. One minute. Oh, I didn't... I actually only have a laser on my shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit, dude. This guy's fucking climbing up here and shit. What the fuck? He's gotta be dead. He's not dead. Oh, my God, dude. What the fuck? That dude took fall damage and everything right there, and then also took a hit and still didn't die. That's fucking wild, dude. 
Yeah, Dylan, I don't know about this. I don't know if you're going to be winning this fight, buddy. With no flashlight on your shit, you only have a laser. Um, yeah, I don't know if you win this, Dylan. You kind of fell short there. Just by barely, too, man. I know that I got that guy so weak right there. I think that he barely got a med off before I hit him with my the last shot that I hit him with. All right, there he is right there. Okay. Yeah, he's dead. Okay. Yeah, I'm not coming back here again in Alley, okay? It was fun, but I'm getting the fuck out of here because the other grub is about to fucking show up and fuck me up, so yeah, I'm out of here. GG's to Anali though, man. He fucked me in the last fight. If that's even how you even say his name, I'm probably saying his name wrong, knowing my silly goose ass. Oh shit, small oil rigs up. Do I want to go there? I kind of do. I'm going to go there. Fuck it. I need to actually get on my computer station before I go there, though, because if blue car door is stuck open... I'm not even going to bring any of my key cards. Shit, can I even see the what's it called, though? The door from here? Oh, yeah, yeah I can. Yeah, no, door's not open. Okay, I know. So I'm going to bring a blue with me. I have a fresh blue, but then I also have a one swipe blue, I think. Uh, Yeah, right there. Boom, okay. Yeah, I'm going to get out here real quick and get murdered by this guy. Um, It's unfortunate, but it's just... It's what can happen, you know? It can happen. Yep, there he is right up there. Look at that. The fuck we doing, man? The fuck we doing? I like how he's like looking to the side now, acting all casual like he's not looking at me. Yeah, sir, I'm leaving. Because I already just get a weird ass vibe about your ass. Not on some cheater shit, but on some shit. Okay? You guys can fill the blank there. Yesterday I tried going to oil rig and speedrunning it bef uh, bef uh, before server restart, and I went there without blue card. And then I get there, and the blue card door is shut, but the red card door was stuck open, right? So that's why I'm only going with a blue card and not a red and blue. Because the red card door should still be glitched open, I think. If it's not, what? We cry. Tears tears never hurt anybody. Let's just kill you real quick. Let's kill you. Wait, I just not heard. I'm hearing some... I just not heard something down there in the water. That's all that I'm going to say. Maybe I'm fine. I think that ribs make make noise in the water. I'm surprised that I only have three meds left. Holy shit, man. I just got beat up. Don't be getting greedy out here, Dylan. That was 14 HP that you had. You should be dead. You deserve to be right now. Yeah, I don't know, man. Like, the rib makes noise, man. I fucking hate that. Yeah, I'm just going to move that rib just over a little bit right now, pretty much. That's all. Maybe I should have brought red card with me. <laughs> Don't, I swear to God, if that door is shut, man. If it is shut now. Get the tunes on. Come on, let's go. Let's get it. Oh, shit. Oh, wait, wait, wait. The boys are here? The boys are here hanging out? Oh, okay. I see how it is with you guys. What about this, though, huh? What about that right there, huh? Uh-huh, uh -huh. you guys like that shit? Okay, is the door open in there? Oh, my God, it's not, I don't think. Son of a- why does this game do this shit? It like, it annoys me because it makes me look so stupid. Like, why not just bring the other card? I know, I don't know, but like, that's the thing though. So many other times, the doors are left open, and then they're just not the moment that I like try and say- Okay, Dylan, okay. There's actually nothing. I actually like, can't go back home and get the red key card because of the server restart now though. Dude, this server restart shit, I'm not gonna lie, it is one of the most annoying things playing in the morning. I just wish that it wasn't a thing at all. Like, I wish that the doors and shit on oil rig wouldn't glitch out whatsoever. I wish that it just was completely not a thing. Because it shouldn't be a thing. The doors should never be glitched and stuck open to begin with. It should never be a thing. But it's been a thing for years and years that they have not fixed. But I'm just going to shut my ass up, move on with my day. I fucked up. Life goes on. 
But yeah, there was no chance that I was going to make it back over there to oil rig with the red key card, which isn't really the biggest deal. I mean, me sitting over there at oil rig for 15 minutes anyway, it's probably not even worth it. I need to raid a base, man. See this one comment. Do you play more confident with a team? Oh, yeah, for sure, all day. A lot more confidence when I play with people. I mean, I've only... I don't even remember the last time that I played with more than just me and my buddy Matt. But uh, even just when I play with him, man, yeah, dude, the confidence is a lot higher. Way, way higher. That's something that I've definitely struggled with over the past, like, year or two as a solo player, man. My confidence has dropped a little bit, but when I think about it, it's not like... Like, it makes sense, though, because I'm not, like, going as hard as I used to with FPS games and shit. Like, I'm just not... I'm not, like, out here practicing and trying to be the absolute fucking best that I can be, right? Should I be? Eh, yeah, probably. And sometimes I get in those phases. Sometimes I get in the phase of just practicing, 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 and then my consistency goes, like, through the roof, and then I'm playing really good. But then it always kind of falls off, and then I just kind of repeat history again and just do it again. And right now, as a player, I feel like I'm playing okay. Pretty average, I feel like. It's nothing, like, super crazy. I feel like I play about as good as your average player at the moment. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean no. Okay, so 10 being as good as you can be and 0 being brand new to the game, I put myself at, like, a 7 or 6.5. That's just me being real with myself, though. Like, I know that I'm not, like... I know that I'm not playing the best out here right now. Where in the world is a base that I can raid, man? Like, I don't know what the hell to raid. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I just can't figure it out. And there's nothing that's, like, really standing out to me. I want there to be, like, some clues on the base. Like, oh, shit, man, that could be stacked. Look at the rugs poking through the walls or whatever it could be, right? A drop box. I mean, there's this thing right here. Should I raid this? <laughs> There is a bear rug sticking through. I mean... Yeah, so it drops down, then it goes around. This right here is the front door. I, I think I'm gonna come over here and just boom into this shit right here. With 2C4, fuck it. Because I gotta raid something. I gotta raid something. And I see someone coming. What I feel like Shots can make a, a great music video reaction channel. Probably not, man. I don't know. Like, when it comes to hip-hop, like, I love hip-hop. And, like, I love dissecting verses and, like... Finding the double entendres, triple entendres, the wordplay, the rhyme schemes, and all that different shit. But I'm not, I'm not sharp enough to really display reactions to the shit. At least right now, because I've got more in tune with hip hop with the things that I just mentioned. Like I've started getting more in touch with that part of hip hop over just like the past like, just over the past like I don't know, uh, couple years, few years. So I don't know. I'm not, I'm not the best with it. Oh my god, what the hell is going on? Okay. Dumb bitch, fuck you. Yeah, and now, yeah, I knew that that was the guy that lived right here above me. Hi, Jacob, I know where you live. Good, raid me, please. Hey, yeah, raid me, get me off of here. Server's already fucking been dying since I got on here four days ago. Literally, the pop has been cut in half since I got on here four days ago. In only four days, half the pop's gone. That's crazy. But yet again, honestly, like, I don't know. As of recent, I think that I'm starting to become more down with just having shorter seasons, guys. Like, I like going in for, like, two weeks straight and having, like, four, you know, like, 14 episodes for a season or maybe even more just on the same server. But, man, dude, these servers are dying out too quick, and I can't do that shit because there's just... It gets to a point where there's just not really many people on the server. Right now, the server's still in an okay state. Like, I've been getting my PvP and shit, but it's, uh... It's, yeah, it's been declining, which sucks, but it is what it is. Here we go, here we go. Time for our first raid. It might, I mean, it might be an embarrassing one, guys. I don't know. I don't know how I'm feeling about this. I mean, I'm happy to see a bear rug poking through the floors that we saw, but still, like, I don't know how I'm feeling about this. I guess what matters is that more raids are going to be on the way, okay? That's what matters. There's going to be some juicy raids on here if we continue to play on here over the next few days. It's just that simple. We'll hit some jackpots. No, this right here is going to be a jackpot. The fuck are you talking about? This is the jackpot raid. This is the this is the raid that changes the whole wipe, okay? This is the raid that gives you an inventory of stones so you can start building up your base, okay? Because that's actually another reason why I haven't built up my base. I'm not just sitting on, like, a bunch of stone right now. And, uh, I don't know. I don't want to go out and farm stone right now. I don't even really care to build right now, so I've just been lazy with my base. Which is, uh, yeah, it's not that... It, yeah, it's not very adult-like of you, Dylan, just so you know. Yeah, let's get in here, though. Got no time to waste. C4 time, baby. TC's unlocked. Fantastic. Alright, we like to see that. We like that. 
Alright, so we got that. We have a C4 back there just now. Okay, that's cool too. Um, come down here. Bullshit. Come right here. Jackhammer, jackhammer, jackhammer. Oh my god, this is not bad. Holy shit. Oh my god, dude. What is this loot in here? Okay, well, yeah, I actually had a jackpot. That's so, that's so great. Pick up the tier two. Drop that, not the grenades. Okay, I just saw the bag name Ho. That's nice. Um, yeah, damn, okay. Yeah, that raid was actually fucking crazy, dude. Holy shit. I mean, I didn't get much scrap back and components, but still. I got like three jackhammers. I don't even have a jackhammer yet on here. Yeah, we actually made it back home too, man. Nice. That, that was actually a massive run. Holy shit. Even got a C4 back too. I love that. It's time to finally commit yourself to work on your base a bit. It needs, it needs worked on. Get your second floor down. Get a loot room down up there. A couple garage doors with it and then call it a day, all right? I'm probably gonna upgrade all this back shit right here to sheet. Um, and then put down garage door, garage door here as well. Um, let's get that down, that down. Oh my god, dude, the freaking trackpad shit on my mouse, dude, it's fucking up. But it's okay, because I have a backup mouse, I'm prepared, okay? But yeah, this shit's been fucking up recently, man, it sucks. I hate it when, ma when mice do this shit. Alright, that's down, this right here, down, cool. Alright, cool, there we go, nice. First barrel can be placed approximately right there okay yeah that's pretty much the end of the session dude i think that before i get off i'll go outside of the db real quick with slug and just see if there's anybody that's outside that i can just pvp with just real quick but other than that man that's a wrap you guys missed out on a little bit to start out because i forgot to start recording like a silly little goose but thankfully i realized instead of not uh, instead of realizing later like right now after this entire session and then yeah like if i just now noticed i Oh, man, I don't even know how I would feel, but I would just have to persevere through it and just accept it. I don't know what my idea would be for a video. Probably, like, a base build or some shit. Like, I'd have to make up my mind quick on what I would want to put out, because a video would have to come out for the day, obviously. Actually, I wonder if anyone showed up to that raid that I did yet, because there was that naked that I killed outside, or wetsuit guy, whatever he had. Dude, he had a good backpack. Oh, my God. Dude, you could have came back and got your shit. This is the pump guy that I heard shooting, I think. Okay, dude, what the hell, man? <laughs> yeah, super quick, I'm gonna go down here, cut down a tree or two, and then I'm gonna go home and uh, plop down a couple more barrels inside the new loot room that I made upstairs. Got the electric dildo right here on the side of this shit. Look at that thing. Hell no. It's even like up there like against the rock, too. Like You just walk up to it and just bend over. And it's these times where I think to myself, like, oh yeah, there's parents that watch me with their kids. But then I also remind myself right after that I'm not I'm like I'm also not like a family friendly content creator or anything. So who really gives a fuck? You know, it's like it's not really my job to like make sure that I'm not saying anything that shouldn't be said to kids. Like I'll tell you right now, fucking Santa Claus, he's my best friend. I fucking love Santa. Okay. <laughs> Shout out to Santa, man. I live inside Santa's basement. May I just mention to the kids out there that are watching, I live in Santa's basement. Yeah, sometimes I get candy canes. Yeah, get these furnaces right here going a little bit, but, uh, yeah, man, I think that I'm gonna just see you guys tomorrow, man. Thank you guys very much for joining me today on this session. Today was a really fun one. Despite us not, uh, recording for the first little bit of the day, we, uh, we ended up going to cargo, fucking up a tugboat squad, escaping with a full inventory, which was dope, and then on top of that, uh, had a little bit of other PvP here around the area. Did our first raid, and it was a good raid. Today was a very good day, man. That was nice, so. I'll see you in the next one. You have a beautiful day or night, whatever time it is for you, and if you're here to get this video, comment the word zapper, okay? I just now said that outro so fucking quick. Oh my god. But yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Uh, yeah, bye. Deep.